Okay, story time. Story time, and then I'll get into the meat of the video here. So, um, impromptu video. I wasn't planning on making a video today. Whenever I, whenever I drop a video, I'm really never planning on making it. In fact, I drop like, you know, three videos in a day, and then uh, uh, don't upload again in six months. Just what happens. Anyway, this is worth putting on the World Wide Web. Um, I'm using my computer camera. My cell phone camera is skipping and awful, and this is just, it won't skip and and have problems saving, but you're dealing with horrible quality on the computer camera, so whatever. Anyway, at the flea market with Billy today, and uh, I owe him some credit because he remembered uh, some cards that a vendor, some baseball cards that a vendor had um, three weeks ago, and we were walking by on our way out, and we said, hey, how much are the cards? And they said, we're not open yet. You got to come back in a week or two. It's like, well, you look open. <laughs> and they just said, no, just come back. So we did, um, and Bill remembered today. Bill um, Bill said, we got to go back and see if that guy is there and has those cards, and they weren't even expensive cards. They were just, you know, junk wax era cards. If you're a baseball card person, you know what that means. They just made a bajillion of you know, a few different brands and they're just not worth anything. Um, unless you get really lucky. <laughs> uh, we got lucky. So three bucks is what they had. It was 1993 Don Ross. Anybody who knows anything about baseball cards knows exactly where this is going. Now the cat's out of the bag. Um, we bought three boxes, 20 bucks total. And, uh, we decided to bust them. You know, we're looking for, uh, uh, Diamond Kings, uh, Mike Piazza rookie card, um, and then the card will never pull, which is an elite series card. Like nobody ever pulls them. They're relatively expensive, at least the autograph ones are. Um, just really tough to pull. So anyway, we crack them. Um, well, we split them up first, and and um, I devised a game. <laughs> of course, I always make some kind of stupid game, and uh, I said whoever you know pulls. More Frank Thomas, Ken Griffey Jr., Cal Ripken Jr. You know, you get a point for each star. Whoever gets more points out of their box and a half um, wins, like five bucks or something like that is what I decided. And he was like, yeah, that's cool. That's fine. That sounds like fun. So anyway, I'm like halfway into my box and this is what happens. I'm, I'm busting packs with Billy. We bought three boxes of 93 Donruss for, for no, I'm sounded to Roberto and I'm cracking. Oh. This is like pack number eight. And I'm like, wait a second. No way. No way. Yes. The elite series, man. Oh, never done that. So I was freaking out. Obviously I was absolutely freaking out there. Um, and I, I wasn't, planning on making a YouTube video at that point in time. It was just fun, and I wanted to send it to my buddy, Roberto, obviously, as I said in the video, because he's a baseball card and he's my boy, so it's just like I wanted to share the moment with him, too. Um, so I didn't, you know, I didn't have any plans. I didn't want to put this on the World Wide Web, whatever, until I get back to the pack that just, you know, the Dennis Eckersley just came out of, and... Um, Anyway, I had to turn on the I had to turn on the camera again. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. Oh, look at this! Same oh. pack! Same oh. pack! Two elites in the same pack, Billy! This one's autographed oh. Will Clark! <laughs> I just pulled two elites out of one. Oh my uh, gosh, this won. is ridiculous. You freaking won. You the won. signature series, Will Clark Elite Series. The odds of pulling these are never, and I just got Will Clark autograph and Dennis Eckersley in the same pack. <laughs> How the hell did you do that? Did you ever think you would see that today? No, I think you brought that with you. Oh my God. You pocket that. You oh my gosh. Purpose. I am nerding out. Yeah, I am well. freaking nerding out. So two in one pack. Oh, I don't know what else to say, man. Just give up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut this. It's a God box. <laughs> So there you go. Two Donruss Elite. Impossible to find inserts in a single pack because some Donruss factory worker probably got lazy and sloppy and tired or 
whatever and forgot they put one in a pack and put another one right into the same pack. Or maybe they did that every so often. I've certainly never heard of it happening. You know, opening any Don Russ box, 91, 92, and 93, it's just a pipe dream of pulling an Elite Series card. And they're not worth that much. They're not. The Eckersley's worth, like, what, 10 or 15 bucks? And uh, Will Clark is worth, like, 50 50 to 75 probably so there you can buy them there's a lot of copies out there but they are impossible to pull because don russ made so many cards which is why the market just completely died as anybody you know who knows anything about baseball cards is well aware so <laughs> i don't you could probably google what are the odds of pulling one of these out of a pack and i think it's like you know 10 or fifteen thousand packs you got to go through to find one of these cards and I'm just rambling now. That That's a wrap. That's really the end of this video. I was super excited. Totally nerding out over this 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 pack of cards. It's, it's the best pack of baseball cards I have ever opened. And it's 1993 Donruss. So I hope you enjoyed this. This is all 110% authentic. Just completely impromptu on the spot. It's videos mashed together. It's using my <laughs> stupid camera on my... Uh, uh, computer. So thank you for watching it. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, see you in six months.